Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel and if you're new here, my name is Esther Mofri. When you open your chart, you'll find this is first attempt. I'll show you, even with rules. So this is our first attempt. Guys, I've told you that if the resistance of the first attempt is broken with a body, it is no longer it is no longer a double top. So this is our first first attempt, meaning our first top. So this is our first attempt. So we are anticipating. You have to anticipate for double top. Nobody will tell you that now it is double top. Anticipate because if you see it uh, already printing, it means you have missed the chance. So we anticipate double tops before even they happen. So that's being our first top. That is our first top, which is first attempt. And then now we are anticipating the market to come here and not to do like this. We don't want the body to close like that. If the body starts closing above, it is no longer a double top. And I'll give you an example. We can see here, we have here the market had touched our first, we had first attempt. We had first attempt here. And then the market did what you can see very clearly the market broke uh, the the resistance. So there's no way you can say that's a double top where the market has broken the resistance. This is what you don't want on your double top. There are people who even it has broken with a body and they are still calling it a double top. If the market breaks like this, this is your first attempt, first top. I can even write for you here. You are anticipating, you had already first top and now we were anticipating for second top so that we can call it double top. If the, if the candle breaks with a body, if this candle, you can see the candle has broken with the body. You can see very clearly the candle has broken. This, this candle, this big candle has broken with the body. So it automatically the, the double top uh, is invalidated because of that. So in this case, what we want here, we don't want... What we are looking here, we don't want the market to break with this box. We want the market to react. So where is our neckline? Our neckline is this zone. This is our neckline. So we will identify our neckline very, very well. So we just come here and write neckline like that. So our neckline is where we have said, if you want to hit TP after you have gotten all the confirmation, our TP is this zone. Don't target more than this. So let's play and see what happens when the market start approaching our our second zone so even you can write for me i write second attempt of second top whichever you want you can say second attempt stroke second top for you to be uh, to be this was first attempt first first top so for you to be to be alert. So we are waiting for second attempt. And we have said we don't want the, the body to break. So we are waiting and the market has touched the first the, it has touched the zone. So we are very close, we are closing our fingers not to the market not to break. And you can see it is almost breaking. We don't know if it will break. It is almost breaking. You can see even the body is very huge. Now let's see what happens. The next candle. You can see this candle is what I'm saying. Guys, if you see such candle in a double top, these are bearish engulfing candle. There is no need of waiting. Oh, I'm not sure. It will give me fake breakout. Guys, if you see a bearish engulfing candle on a zone like this, we are entering sell immediately. So here we come. We put short position. And now we are targeting. We are targeting what? We are targeting to the neckline. I've told you our target is the neckline. Uh, stop loss is above that high. And now we wait and see. Let's see what happens. So the market is pushing, pushing down, pushing, going to our neckline. And it is easy as just waiting for the market to hit your TP. And you can see the market hit our TP very, very well. Very, very well. So, guys, what I can tell you uh, is that the minute the market has uh, has given you a confirmation of entry, you have seen, you just look of two candles. You look for a bearish engulfing. 
or a WBB strategy. If it was a very small candle, we could have put a box. If it is a small candle like here, you put a box. If it breaks, now you enter because you don't want to be, uh, you don't want to, you don't want to enter very early and it be uh, the, the, the pattern was fake breakout. So for you to avoid all that, you just have two candles that you are watching. Either a bearish engulfing candle or if it is a small red candle, you put a box. So for us, the market has broken this neckline. You see, the market has broken the neckline. So eventually, this market will come to this zone. So many people will come here and buy and sell, sorry. But what I tell you guys is that don't sell immediately when you see this uh, market. Wait for retest and I'll now I'll show you where WBB strategy is happening or is being applied. So many people don't know how far will it retest. So let's see. Now that one was a win. So we are waiting for retest. We see the second candle. So the second candle starts retesting. Key thing, do not enter the market or do not enter sell with a green candle. We want to enter sell. So we are looking for a sell candle. So the market keeps retracing back. And then eventually it gives us a very small candle. This is what I was saying. Most of the time you'll be given this small candle here at the beginning. What I'm saying is that come and put a box. Put a box. Do WBB strategy. And then... Uh, right here, WBB, wait box break. That's what WBB means. Wait, I'm waiting for box break because we don't know if this is a fake out. We don't know if it is um, the market still wants to retest. It can, it can come to many positions. It can come to here or it can come all the way up there. So we don't know where the price wants to go. So with this box, we already know if it breaks the box, we are entering. So let's see what happens. The market uh, doesn't break the box, so we adjust our box. We are adjusting our box, and the market does not break. So we don't enter that market, and eventually you can see, guys, if you had entered here, see what happens. Many people entered sell here. If we had entered here, what would have happened? We could have, we could have lost that trade if our stop loss was near so we are still waiting because the trade is valid the trade is very very valid because it has broken it broke the neckline so until it has a red candle that's when we enter so you can see with a very very big candle now we have a confirmation that this trade the buyers and the sellers are ready now to take this market down so what you do you enter sell position because that's an engulfing candle. So you come here, you short that market. You enter that sell. And then the stop loss, be careful because you don't know if the market can come away there. So the stop loss can be, you can do uh, how many pips, like 50 pips stop loss. And then now you wait for the market to 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 go to your direction so how many gains do you want to to tp you want 133 pips so let's see what happens after you have entered that trade so let's see what happens we can play it so you can see the market came uh came down to almost hitting our tp and it has hit our tp you can see so what what did we avoid from all this what we were avoiding is early entry we avoided entering here getting all the way being discouraged but the trade has gone to our entry so guys if you will be able to trade this way a double top uh pattern you will make so much money so what i can tell you guys is that if the beginning of your of your double top you have a very small candle put a box if you have a bearish engulfing candle enter immediately if the market breaks the neckline wait for retest the wait for retest you have to wait for red candles to start printing so that you can put that box when once that box is broken you can enter if the the, the red candle prints and it engulfs the green one you don't need a box you'll enter immediately thank you guys for watching i hope this strategy for uh 
uh, trading double top it will really help you and i hope you'll start making in money thank you so much for watching until next time bye bye love